I'm going to show you 12 tips on how to fix every Fortnite crash, every Fortnite glitch, bug, error or uh, something else that doesn't let you open Fortnite or the Epic Games launcher. First of all, I want to tell you that there are uh, there are 12 tips and I don't know which will work for you. Maybe it will be the first one, maybe the second one, maybe the last one. So uh, what I want you to do is to restart your PC if you can do that and try opening and running Fortnite and playing it after every uh, fix. So basically that way uh, you won't have to try every fix in this video. So let's start. The first uh, Fortnite uh, tip or the first fix is open the search menu, type this PC, open it, go to local disk C, go to program files, open Epic Games, Fortnite, Fortnite game, binaries, uh, win64. Okay, so now, uh, first of all, I want you to go to BattleEye, open the BattleEye folder, click on uninstall BattleEye, click on yes, and now click on install BattleEye. Okay, so that's done. Now you can try and restart your PC or you can directly open Fortnite and see if it works. The second fix is open this PC again. Go to local disk C, go to program files, go to Epic Games, open Fortnite, Fortnite game, binaries, Win64, basically the same. Now what you want to do is find these applications and what you want to do is right click on the first one, click on properties, go to compatibility and run the compatibility troubleshooter. The troubleshooter will detect any issue that Fortnite might have and it will also tell you the recommended settings for your, the Fortnite game. So click on try recommended settings. Okay, so now it says that uh, you should run the uh, Fortnite game compatible for Windows 8. So click on next. And the uh, uh, settings will be automatically applied. Click on next again. Okay, and click on cancel. Now, what you want to do is check run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8. Check the disable full screen optimizations and run this program as an administrator. Click on apply and click on OK. You want to do that. This, uh, you want to do the same for the uh, Fortnite client Win64 shipping VE. Fortnite client Win64 shipping EAC and the Fortnite launcher. So just do the same. Okay, so that's it. Now just uh, run Fortnite again and see if this fix worked, worked for you. The third fix is open this PC again. And just do the same as uh, the previous tip. Local disk C, program files, Epic Games, Fortnite, Fortnite game, binaries, and go to uh, go to Win64. Uh, I want just to say I want to say that uh, if you don't have Epic Games in local disk C, then just go to this PC and search for Epic Games. This will automatically find the folder and you can d just do the same from there now what you want to do for uh, what you want to do for this fix is go to easy anti cheat click on the easy anti cheat setup and click on repair service 
this will take just like 10 seconds it will not take long and there it is click on finish and that's the third fix just uh, open fortnite now and see if this fix works for you the fourth fix is to open fortnite go to the settings in game and now what you want to do is maybe just put everything on low or do not go, uh, do not put the quality on aura because this will just mess up your game so just put everything on low or uh, put shadows and effects definitely on low because this are the ones that will co uh, that cause your crash now put the frame rate limit on 60 fps if it's on uncapped just put it on 60 fps on unlimited put it on 60 fps and what you want to do is turn vsync on now if you want you can lower the 3d res resolution but i won't do that just mess with the settings a little bit and try what uh, works for you. Click on apply and you can now exit Fortnite. That's the fourth tip. The fifth tip is very easy. Just open the Epic Games launcher. Okay, wait, close Fortnite. Wait for it to update. okay click on settings on this icon and click on verify this is an easy tip but it may work for you the next tip is open the search menu type r e g e d i t open it now let me just close this all okay go to HQ local machine go to system go to current control set go to control and find graphics drivers and open it click on it ju just click on it okay so now what you want to do what you want to do is click on new cl the right click and the graphics drivers folder click on new click on dword thr uh, 32 bit name the uh, dword tdr level okay and now what you want to do is just open it click on it and set the value to zero once you're done just click on ok and close it try fortnite and see if this fix worked for you the next tip is to open the search menu, type device manager, open it, now uh, just expand display adapters, adapters and what you want to do is update the drivers for your graphics card, just right click on it click on update driver click on search automatically for updated driver software and wait for it to, fin to finish okay so the next tip is right click on epic games launcher click on properties and now what you want to do is just add the following code to target okay so there it is just add this click on apply and click on ok now you can try and run fortnite and see if this fix work the next tip is to open the task manager just right click on the windows icon on the windows logo and find task manager okay and click on it Now what you want to do is just close the Epic Games Launcher. As you can see, the Epic Games Launcher for me is in background processes. 
and that means that uh, even though uh, maybe you uh, didn't you don't remember f opening the game the launcher already is open o uh, it works so just click on it and click on end task this will close the launcher and now you can click on it uh, again to open it and maybe the fortnite crash uh, you're trying to fix will be f fixed with this tip the next fix is right click on the windows watch in the bottom right corner click on adjust date time and make sure that set time automatically is on and set time zone automatically is also on some fortnite crashes may be because the uh, clock that you have on your computer on your laptop isn't uh, this isn't the same as the epic games launcher clock the next tip is open cmd right, uh, right click on it and click on run as administrator now what you want to type is ip config renew just click enter and wait for it to finish and the last tip is to open search type reset this PC and open it click on get started and this will uh, reset your PC to uh, this will reset your PC but will save the your files or remove them depends on what you want this may take some time around eight to nine hours for me but this will most definitely fix it if none of the fixes worked for you that's it thanks for watching please subscribe like and comment and if you're having any problems with the fixes uh, if you don't know what to do or if you can't find the epic games folder or something else like that just comment and i'll just reply you with reply to you with a fix for that thanks for watching and bye